Good afternoon, my name is Brad King. I'm District Manager for Alpine in Eastern Ontario, and I'd like to talk to you today about installing a kit on corn planters. It's uh, pretty straightforward here. Uh, all components on, the, on all corn planters are basically the same. It's all the same concept, and it's very simple to, uh, to install. I'm going to start today with the pump. Uh, the pump is a diaphragm pump, and it can run in either direction, so it doesn't matter which way it goes on, on the planter. Um, we have a series of different types of pump mounts that can be put on uh, there to, depending on the kit that you have or the planter you have, it can, uh, it can uh, mount on there quite easily, it just bolts on. As far as the pump is concerned, uh, when driving the pump, I'd like to pick, uh, pick up the, uh, the input shaft after the drive clutch so that when you pick the, uh, pick the uh, unit up, it will, uh, it will shut off at the end of the field and it will start immediately when you put it back down at the end of the field or at the beginning of the field. So this particular unit runs off a rub wheel and the rub wheel, the shaft that we're picking up is the input shaft of the, of the transmission. So you can change the seed, uh, seeding rate and you're not going to change the, the, the rate of the, the speed of the pump. So when we're looking at the pump here, there's one thing that we'd like to start at the beginning. I like to see a strainer in front of the uh, pump and uh, this particular strainer is, is mounted underneath the tank. It can be mounted on the input shaft or input pump of the uh, input of the pump. Um, this pump uh, in at the bottom and out at the top. Um, so that's, uh, that's very important. Um, our adjustment, it's all, all calibrated with the pressure versus speed. Uh, this is our, our adjustment here. It's a pressure regulating valve. This pressure rating valve operates the opposite of a water tap. Out is less pressure, uh, more bypass, and in is more bar, uh, less bypass, and more pressure. From there, we go, we go to uh, the pressure gauge. Um, the pressure gauge on this unit uh, is a remote pressure gauge. The pressure gauge can originate from the manifold, or it can, it can originate uh, from the pump here. We have uh, in the kit what's called the pressure gauge kit, and it comes with all the fittings and holes you need to move that from the pump or the manifold up to the front of the unit where you can see it and we can take a uh, look at that uh, later on. 